Hello and welcome. This is the first video in a series of home movies from my grandma and pops cruise around the world. I have scanned these films from Super 8 using a device that digitally scans both types of 8mm film. To crop and stabilize the film, I used Vegas Movie Studio, and later I will be making a video to show you the process I used to get this. to look like this. The raw files produced by the scanner are watchable, but they have this jitter to them. Partly because of the scanning mechanism not being able to align the frames up in exactly the same position each time it scans. Regarding the quality that you see in these reproductions today, in their final state, you have to realise that the frame we are scanning here on an 8mm film is only about 6 to 7mm wide. For you non-metric folk out there, a millimetre is a 30 secondeth of an inch. Because the automatic stabilization filter zooms into each frame and crops out a lot, I have manually recropped the scenes to include as much of the frame real estate as possible. Sometimes you will see the edge of the film frame jut into view from any of the sides and then disappear again. This is a sign that I have widened the view almost to the original size and you are almost seeing all of the original frame or that the current scene had to be heavily stabilized and the frame was shifted as much as it had to be to keep the subject of the shot in one place. I have inserted the original sound from my Sankyo Dual X 1000 projector into the audio track as these films have no sound. I wanted to emulate the home movie projector experience but feel free to mute the audio and play your own music or listen to a podcast while you watch. These are the films from my grandmother's 1970 ocean cruise around the world. She went with her husband, who we call Pop, my mum's uncle Les, and Pop's sister. They visited places like New Zealand, San Francisco, California, Disneyland, Universal Studios, Vancouver, Honolulu, Wales, Scotland, Paris, Rome, and Venice. The last reel is from when Grandma and Pop visited various parts of North Queensland. Grandma lived in Queensland, but in the southeast region, just west of Brisbane. The two main ships that they travelled on were the Oriana and the P&O ship called the Canberra. You won't see any of Pop in these films because he was the one operating the camera the whole time. You will see my grandmother and Pop's sister at various attractions, and sometimes you will see them walking here and there amongst the sites as part of the background. It has been 53 years since these films were recorded, and I think there may have been a family evening when a projector was there to show some of them, but in general there are reels here that have not been seen for decades. I also have my great uncle Eric's 8mm films, which are from my dad's side of the family. They are from his trips around Europe and some parts of Australia in the early 60s. I have scanned every reel that is available to me, and I will be stabilizing all of them for my family to see after all these years. Uploading these videos to YouTube was an afterthought, in case someone out there wanted to see some old home movies of some well-known cities around the world as they looked on 8mm film in 1970. Grandma's World Cruise films have been uploaded in 9 videos as there were 9 reels. They vary in length from 16 to 20 minutes on average. I have tried my best to identify some of the locations as best I can. If anyone out there can help identify something that I have not, please leave a comment with a timestamp and it will be greatly appreciated. So here's reel 1. I really do hope you enjoy what you see. And as they say, bon voyage and bye for now.